Hello everyone, welcome to BSP Solution. My name is Shubham Timre and in today's session, we are creating a standard process work order in Oracle Fusion Supply Chain Management Manufacturing Application. So in our earlier session, we already seen how to create a standard work order in our application and what attributes required to create a standard work order. So in today, session we are creating a standard process work order so you can create a standard process work order or we can say the discrete uh, work order based on the manufacturing like discrete manufacturing or we can say the process manufacturing work method so if the plant parameter is enabled for process manufacturing then you can make a standard process work order okay so before we start to create a standard process work order let's check the plant parameter for our manufacturing organization okay well, let's go to our instance yeah okay so first we have to check our plant parameter click on setting an action then click on setup and maintenance so under setup uh, manufacturing and supply chain material management scroll it down yeah manufacturing master data okay. click on manage plan parameter okay so here we have a checkbox that is for enable process manufacturing if your manufacturing organization is process manufacturing you just have to enable the process manufacturing okay so in organization 002 this checkbox is not enabled okay so organization 430 that is for the process manufacturing so let's select the organization and check that plant parameters for organization 430 yeah yeah that the checkbox is enabled enable process manufacturing checkbox is enabled so your default work method is process manufacturing either you can select discrete manufacturing or you can select process manufacturing so in accordance to your use your manufacturing plant parameter you can select your manufacturing work method so here is the manufacturing work method that is the process manufacturing okay just click on save and close now after checking the plant parameter we are creating the standard process work order okay so click on navigator so under navigator we have supply chain execution task under that subtask work execution so just click on work execution so here our organization that is 002 okay so as we already created our work order in 002 inventory organization from here yeah, just click on create a standard work order so, okay so here item quantities okay so these are the thing for particular standard work order for discrete manufacturing now we are creating the standard work order for our process manufacturing so for that first we have to change our organization okay okay you must close okay yeah, no sure just click on navigator click on work definition click on change organization select our manufacturing organization that is 430 and just click on ok yeah done click on navigator and again click on work execution task yeah organization that is 430 now click on the task list so under task list we have the task manage work order so just click on manage work order okay so in 002 organization the items are the mandatory attribute okay so here the mandatory attribute is process name okay so for method here for you can select either process manufacturing or we can say the discrete manufacturing so in accordance to your manufacturing parameter or we can say the work method you can select your work method right now we are selecting process manufacturing we are creating a standard process work order so work method that is process manufacturing now the creation basis so on what basis you are creating the standard work order okay 
the process name or we can set the primary output primary output is over here okay so as we select primary output yeah yeah primary output is come over here yeah yeah the primary output or we can send the primary name so what is the basis for creation the this particular work order so right now we are selecting the process name okay okay so in our earlier session we already seen our process how to create the particular process right now we are selecting the process that is uh, juice from concentrate okay juice from concentrate okay. click on search icon yeah process name juice from concentrate primary output that is yeah description bulk supremo fitness string yeah in earlier session we already created uh, okay uh, item that is fitness string so process name that is juice from concentrate line one okay so select on click on okay the batch quantity as we select okay so all the details like process name batch quantities okay and the unit of measure that is gallon okay the primary output Let's just click on our primary output that is the fitness drink yeah bulk supremo fitness drink that is our primary output you can see uh, the specification structure attachment relationship and association for that particular item okay just click on done okay yeah now you can change your batch quantity let's say 2000 so in accordance to your specification you can specify your batch quantity okay if you want to provide any additional description for that particular juice from concentrate you can fill it over here here the subtypes that is the standard production prototype or what kind of like repair the like pilot lot or test slot you can select okay status you can change the status from here as well okay the default status that is unreleased or you can select the released or uh, our on hold let's say our status is released okay the work definition that is production line one the date and time the version okay the all the detail just click on seven add it okay your all the detail status is released the work definition details yeah all the details are over here work method that is process manufacturing this particular work order is for process manufacturing the what is our work order number yeah work order 430 is our organization and 1036 is the work order number yeah okay the completion information with the completion information you can select all the mandatory attributes are already selected yeah just click on operation tab yeah first operation that is we can so reconstitute yeah, the items are, what is the item white items are the input okay and the output output is form of let's select the reconstitute output is i think uh, organic waste yeah organic waste reconstitute output is organic waste okay and the mix so mix uh, output that is your pulp pulp from the fruit okay and the cool the finish coat items our fitness drink yeah bulk supremo fitness drink our finish coat items yeah the drink product the categories and the specification structure so all the details and another one that is juice sample okay so that is the outputs for our work order inputs they are the inputs multiple inputs we have like juice concentrate okay another input that is uh, filtered water so yes the resources in form of labor or we can set the equipment or machinery okay yeah okay so as we all know that the, for each operation 
we require multiple resources in form of technician storage tank filtration tank and the refrigerator refrigerated tank just click on save and close okay if you want to release just click on row let's click on release yeah straight as that is release so in this way you can create an standard process work order in a manufacturing application okay so thank you for watching the video thank you so much